Water. <laughs> My next guests are literally barking about their pampered poochies. They indulge them with the very best food, accessories, even acupuncture. And 70% of dog owners are going to buy their pets a present for Christmas. So they're here to give us a lowdown on the best canine Christmas gift. Please welcome Joe Good and her dog Matilda. Hello. 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 And Anna Webb and Molly. Hello. 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 All right. <laughs> And lovely to have you back. Of course, thank when you were here oh, before, we had all the wonderful accessories it. that you had, and you know, and that was yeah. very summary. It's only mm. appropriate, I think, that dogs get indulged all year round. Of course. Um, Can I just say, Gabby, this snorting is Matilda, not me. <laughs> yeah, not, not Rich. I thought Rich just got a bit comfortable on the sofa. <laughs> oh, can I say one of the dogs tried to snog me? But it's, uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. they Rich, so not everybody tries to snog <laughs> oh, okay. you. This is becoming a theme now. Um, this is uh, Lindsay Noble's email. She sent a picture of her dog dressed up and waiting for Santa paws. Oh, so there you go. Oh, Look. Sweet. Yes, you've got a fan there. And yes. so what we've done, well, we haven't done this, of course. The dogs have written letters to yeah, Santa Claus. Have, have. This is not us at all. Um, <laughs> and um, I have the letters here, which oh, is a bit naughty, Mr. really. Oh, Molly, what yes. did you say? Yes, this is your letter. This is Molly's letters first. What lovely writing Molly has. Oh. Dear Santa Claus, I have been very good this year, and Anna has not spoilt me enough. Oh. There are various things I absolutely need, oh, not God. even want. <laughs> Love, Molly. Oh, oh. gosh. Yeah, so... Uh, the first one <laughs> is an equifleece jumper. Does Mummy know where to buy that from? Yes, well, <laughs> Mummy does. Mummy has actually got Molly in an equifleece, oh. which is wonderful. Because Molly gets fed up of her cashmere sweaters getting mm. soaked and, and they soggy. take so long they to wash. In the rain. They take exactly. forever to wash. So this is wonderful. Molly hates going out in the rain. So this wonderful polar So is this waterproof as well? It is water repellent. So the water just bone, rolls off. Yeah, it keeps her bone dry. But also, if she gets... Listen to the the sound of Christmas bells coming in the background. Listen to that. It's a sound of but Christmas. But if Molly were to get soaking wet, the wonderful thing about the fleece is you mm. pop it on and it works like a tumble dryer. It literally just sucks all the water out of the coat. We could all do with one of those, Absolutely. Rich, couldn't yeah. we? Oh. You're left with a lovely, dry, clean dog. So you've left the park. Fantastic. Well, it's muddy, about 15 soggy, pounds, doggy. depending on size. And by the time you get home, you've got a lovely, dry, clean doggy. Fantastic. Hurrah. The, yeah. second <laughs> thing, the second thing Molly wants is the Tallulah Turkey. Turkey Tuffy Dog Toy. Ah, oh, oh, well, yes. I think there's this one here. This is about here. £29.99. Yes. This is fantastic. This is wonderful, and there'll be no confusion as to which turkey you put in the oven this Christmas. <laughs> um, but what's great about the Tallulah's Tuffy Turkey is this. It's got hidden squeaks in its plumage. Oh, I think it's got hidden depths. Oh, so hidden depths. Depth. Well, and <laughs> hidden depths. So it's got, like, a lovely squeak here. Oh, look, yeah, so look, look Moles. Moles, do you like your turkey? Yes, look, it's definitely. it's turkey. She doesn't look Tallulah. surprised, Anna. No, she no. doesn't she did see it. Oh, I think she right. spoiled it a little yeah. bit. Yeah. Yeah. I think you should have kept <laughs> that one back. It should be Christmas every day. <laughs> yes, Rich. Can you get that wet? Can you get it wet? <laughs> what are you thinking? What are you thinking? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I just thought what, you, drown the turkey. You could get the fleece in the turkey and just, oh, yeah. you know. You probably could play in the bath with it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm sure it would dry let's, very let's quickly. Let's move on to the third oh, present, which is the Kong Wobbler. Oh, yes. Um, this sounds a bit adult. It's ten ninety nine, and it's yeah. from Pet Necessities. It is. I think you can get it oh. in lots of places. Oh, this, this is, is it. Fantastic. This is the Kong Wobbler. This is an interactive toy that basically works the dog's brain and, you know, its paws and its nose all at once. It's a boredom buster. What you do, you pop lovely treats into here. We like to put um, uh, chopped carrot because mm -hmm. of waistlines put and everything. Put your meatball in. Anna keeps meatball well, in her bra. Well, we're going to save the meatball for later. <laughs> oh, right. We do have a bit of homemade <laughs> biscuit in the bra. Yes. And um, so what you do, you literally, no Molly, wait. You basically pop some biscuit in here and then you simply screw this together and right. they can actually play with it and get the food out yeah what, what molly will do is whack it and basically it goes ping 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 everywhere oh, so it really exercises the dog and the treats fly everywhere and the dog doesn't know where the treats are going to go so it's what brilliant. a great gift yeah. well done. keep their minds healthy yeah. and oh yes, yes. yes. Molly. 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 Dishwasher proof, so it's good in water. Thank you. Uh, right, can we move on to Matilda? Yes, please. Now? Okay. Dear Santa Claus, I have behaved even better again this year, and yes, I deserve please. everything I ask for, and I won't accept anything less. She's yeah. a bit materialistic, isn't she? <laughs> Lots of love, Matilda. I think Matilda does deserve everything that she desires, and the first thing she wants 
is the snowman father christmas outfit yes oh. well this is she's a little bit overheated actually in her snowman yes. father christmas she peaked a bit earlier um she was racing around in it i love it because from an angle she can also be a rhinoceros she, she <laughs> can <laughs> yes With yeah. the, sort of the carriage effect it keeps her nice and warm yes. um one lying down, I think, Rich, it was you that mistook her for a footstool, um, because she lying flat out. Rich, have you anything. got a question about this? <laughs> no. <laughs> I think you can get this wet, Rich, as well, actually. I'd like so. to get you wet. <laughs> uh, this is, this is um, from a major department store. She's got this one. She's also That got one's from the major department store beginning with an H. With an H. Yeah. Yes. And um, you can get these. She's also got a hippopotamus one that she wears in the day okay. as well. All these gifts, by the way, are on the website, so yes. you can get all the information there. Uh, that's quite expensive. That one's Nearly 40 pounds, yes. 37 95 uh, The second present that Matilda would like is the slider educational toy. Oh, this one here. This is fantastic. So Let me just show you this. Mm. This is like a Mensa toy. It's like testing their IQ, basically. Yeah, um, yeah. Matilda isn't the sharpest knife in the drawer, as you probably realise, <laughs> but <laughs> she's very well-meaning, and, and food <laughs> will actually encourage her to drink mm. it. So I'm going to oh, show no, you this. Oh, she's got it. Look, yep. she knows what she's and doing. And hopefully she'll use her paw. If I put this under here, she shouldn't have seen it, obviously, but there Come we are. Come on, Matilda. Come on, Matilda. Don't let me down. You Work can it. do it. <laughs> See, it would, if she uses her paw, then it's better. You know, actually, this but. would also be good for Jedward. <laughs> 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 no, it's uh, Let's move on to the next toy, uh, which is the Twist toy. Oh, oh by the way, that one's twenty-eight pounds. Again, you can find out about it on the website. Oh, the Twist toy looks now, interesting. Yes. This is this is slightly uh, crude. Sorry, uh, it, um, we could put the Swedish meatball in. Yes, so. this is the Swedish meatball. You pop it in this hole here, and it's a, it's a wonderful fit, actually. Yes, um, and dogs go crazy for a they Swedish do. meatball. What what do you think the most attractive thing about this is, Rich? Nothing. Um, <laughs> <laughs> it's it's biodegradable. Is that it's, right? Yeah, it's really eco-friendly. Yeah. yeah. So in hundreds of years, it won't exist. No. That's sad. I yeah. Know. That's right. Totally but, but, um, <laughs> Get lots of use in the meantime. <laughs> yes, <laughs> and you can twist literally. Mm. You do it, Annika. Yeah, you so you get the dead legs dead or the handles, oh, I see. and you yeah. can, you know. Tie and you it can together. hurl it. You can you literally can hurl, hurl it, it and then make it a lovely fetch toy. But then when the legs are like this, it obviously makes it quite difficult to yeah. get to the Swedish meatball. So it's quite a frustrating <laughs> toy, isn't yeah. it? It is. It is quite frustrating. But it, they have to use patience to get yeah. there. So patience. What lovely like toys. Ooh, well, um, all of those cool. on the website. But we, of course, would like to have some presents for you. So the dogs yes. have um, asked us we to suggest, them. or you to suggest some presents that they can buy you. They're yes. going shopping later, apparently. Oh, yes. um, the scarves. Oh, oh these, yes, are, these are amazing. Every dog owner should have one of these. They're so warm. These are from these Love My Dog. These and I have to say, love my dog. Yeah. you guys, Anna and Joe, gave me the most gorgeous one of these, a red one earlier on, which I'll be wearing to walk my dog at oh, some point. And, and they're, they're hand-knitted, Gabby. Oh, and so warm. Feel this, they Rich. Are, <laughs> yeah, you can get that wet. You might not be able to get that wet. I'm going to bring this to the top. <laughs> oh, you love that, don't you? Um, they're very long, so you can um, really wrap them around several times. And little coats to go with them for the dogs. So, oh, you know, do you match? Yes, yeah, mm, mix and match. Lovely. You, just yeah. you look like one. Doctor Who. You look you lovely. That. That soft and we and can't lovely. hear your mic anymore. <laughs> so if you want to speak again, you're going to have to take it off. <laughs> <laughs> Casting directors. <laughs> Doctor Who. Um, and the dog tag. What's oh, that? Oh, yes. Oh. This is for the human, though. Yes. Well, they are. you can wear them around your neck, or you can wear them yeah. as a bracelet. They are... Designed by Gunilla Carlson, actually. She's fantastic. Yeah. She's a silversmith. Oh, so this has got Molly on yes. it. Yes, very And this has got handmade. Matilda. And they're Solid handmade. Solid silver. Solid silver. Mm -hmm. They're the most beautiful. They are quite a classy. What do you think, Rich? You they're quite they're little I crowns. They're yeah, yeah, little crowns. And they're lovely. And because all dogs need to wear an ID tag. I also, yes. I'm, I've got my eye on the festive collars. Look I at think this. every oh, dog fantastic. should have one of those on Christmas Jingle Day. Bells. They're this fantastic. This is uh, Holly and Lil. Jingle and they're all the way. fantastic. That's, I mean, you could wear that yourself to a party as a headband or anything. But <laughs> yes. they, guys, one of those eyes as always, wide shut parties. fantastic yes. gifts. <laughs> Wonderful to have you here. The dogs are well behaved. They can come back. Rich, you can come back as well. Good luck with the music show and everything else you're doing. Tomorrow, we've got the comedy actress and star of Miranda, Sarah Hadland here, comedian Chrissy Rock talking about life in the jungle. Uh, a mum of three shares her joy of becoming a surrogate mum for others. And Kirsty is going to a seafood school for some festi festive, see another act of rebellion, fishy dishes. <laughs> All that and loads more, 10 past 11 here on Channel 5. Have yourself a wonderful day. Thanks for your company. Bye.